hey, welcome uh, to a, a brand new series that we're doing. Oh, wow, gee. Oh, this ain't good. Who thought it was a great idea to bring a raft into the middle of the ocean? Oh, I thought you said you had a yacht! Yuck! Look, I, I I think big, okay? My yacht is just a little boat. Wind Waker was never this hard. Oh, come on. <laughs> this is the extreme mode. European extreme Wind Waker. Dog shit! Dead Link died. The series is over. Yep. Wow, fast Zelda game. Yeah. They are getting shorter. I can't wait for Tears of the Kingdom to be 15 minutes long. Ooh, you must be at the extended edition. Oh. Must be if you get the expansion pass. Ah, <laughs> indeed. DLC extends the life of all games. So I guess the lightning struck Link so hard that he died and got transported to Playmobil Land. That looks like a diorama. It looks so pretty. Ah, oh, another boy washed up on our island. Awesome! Awesome with the rest! <laughs> Robinson Crusoe and the guy from Survival <laughs> yeah. Kids and, and Kirby and Kirby yeah, and Kirby Forgotten yeah. Land, you know. Oh, but that's yeah. not Kirby. This is a, a big old Yoshi egg. That's it's not it's not Mario or Yoshi either. Yeah, that's what I thought it's it was. It's the Legend of Zelda: Yay! Link's Awakening remake. Link's Awakening. I've oh. never beaten this game. Oh, I love Zelda: Link's Awakening. It was actually one of the first you know games I actually you know played. As a functioning adult. Yes! And I, and I loved it so much. I just... Uh oh. Well, no, well, no, 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 yeah, take that's, that away. Yeah, that's, that. That, that's, that's, my, that's my full story. You know, I beat the game already, and I mm, tried yes. to do hero mode, but it didn't go it's, it's hard. so well. Hero mode's hard. And I also died five times, and, uh, well, there's a special cutscene you get at the end of this game if you beat the game without dying. Without dying, okay. And aside from just, uh, shooting the shit and playing some uh, good old-fashioned Zelda Link's Awakening with, yeah. my, with my buddy here, I want to beat this game without dying, so let's do that. But first, my friend, there's a bunch of secrets in this game, did you know? I did not know. Oh, there is. There is. Alright, so we got Norwell and Hero where you dick, you know, yeah, no, we're just gonna go yeah, with Norwell. Let's just go with Classic difficulty. Right, enter your name. Of course, we all know of the one that, uh, yeah, let's see if you go ahead and name yourself as Zelda. Wait, really? Yep. Ooh. Whoa! Yeah, how about that, huh? They kept that in from the original Game Boy? Yeah. That's so cool! Yeah, me. But that's not all. Uh... Marin? Marin. Who is the girl who uh, found us on the shore? The recurring theme in the game, The Hell. Ballad of the Windfish. Ballad of the Windfish. Great song. Yeah. That's lovely. I like the instrumentation, too. Good stuff, good stuff. And would you believe, there's one more. Name yourself Mario. Nope. No. Uh, Nintendo. <gasps> yeah! Yeah, man. Wow. See, like, the game hasn't started, and we've already got so many secrets, it's great. Let's actually start the game now. I yes. Went, I went back too far. Yeah, I'm there. Alright, so new game, normal mode. Gotta gotta have a name. What should the name be? Uh... uh well, we, we've already uh, used Nisk DJ yeah. and, uh... L L oh, hell yeah! Linkma. Linkma balls. Oh, damn it! I ah! fell for it! Gosh dang it! I'll get that out of the way. Well, now every time somebody says, Oh, Linkma, it's like, <laughs> Linkma <my> ball! <laughs> 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 Why do you always got that stupid look on your face, kid? <laughs> oh, Merod, what seems to be a problem with the boy? Oh, he has a bad case of Linkma. What a relief. <laughs> I Hi. thought you'd never wake up. You were tossing and turning. What, Zelda? Uh -huh. This is like direct one-to-one -one, uh, of the the uh, dialogue from the Game Boy version. Hoholint Island. As far as I know, none of the dialogue's been changed. <laughs> Possibly updated for the Switch version, a, but nothing major. A few major. things, like like a couple of things, but most of this directly from the Game Boy version. Okay. Well, Link, my Balls. finally <laughs> stepped out of it. <laughs> Name's Taren. Hope you're feeling better. What? How did I know your name? You think it's weird, eh? Well, I saw it on the back of this shield. 
This is already one of the great things about this remake. You get your shield back. I can't remember how and you, you can just it. hold R. That, oh, that's right. You can just hold R to use your shield. You had to. It had to be like its own separate button in the original version. I do remember that the sword and shield are now their own separate buttons on the Switch, and you can still hold two items. I think. Yes. Yes. Okay. Sorry, it's been a while. It's been about what twenty years? Oh, it has been a long time. I have a small issue with this game, though. What's that? I don't like the weird eight-directional movement. This oh, instead of it being fluent, it's it, it very direct. It just feels kind of, like, weird and stilted and... Oh, just, just, it's alright. I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind so much the fact that the D-pad doesn't do anything. This is, this is perfect for D-pad movement, but they just don't let you use it. Interesting. It drives me nuts. I am... I am gone insane. Yeah, what do these kids say? I hear that when you're running out of hearts, you better go find a big fairy. Why? I have no idea. I'm just a kid! Huh. Well, alright. So you follow the path down here. Octorox! Takes you down to the beach. I guess you head right here. Are those Gordos? Something, nice, nice. Something akin. There's a lot of uh, Nintendo franchise uh, representation. Cameos, I guess is the word. Yeah, okay, cameos is a good descriptor. Like, they're not... Oh, hey, hey! Oh. There it is! And of course, this owl guy. Kapora Gabora? It just sounds like you made that up. Th that's what he was called in Ocarina of Time. Is I, I don't know. Call this owl Kapora Gabora. Kapora Gabora! Kapora Gabora! Yeah, alright, gotta go north now. To the mysterious forest. The reason why uh, we came to get the sword because we, I mean, we gotta get the sword. I mean, look at the sword. It's so cool. It's a fucking sword. Give me that sword! It must be mine because it's mine! <laughs> I found it first. It's mine! Yeah! So, uh, this took me forever as a kid. I didn't make it very far in Link's Awakening, and I was so happy when the remake got announced because I finally had a chance. And guess what? I still haven't done it, so this will be, uh, partially blind for me. Well, there's gonna be things that you don't even know about. I mean, you didn't even, you didn't even know about the names at the start. Oh, no. I had no oh, idea. Yeah. We're gonna, we're gonna see if we can't find all the secret seashells, and we're gonna do the, the trade of the, 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 the trade sequence and all that. I'm down for that. Oh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be, it's gonna be good. So, uh, funny thing, uh, you, Violet, and I were watching the direct when this was announced. Yes. And as soon as I saw the water, I knew it was Link's Awakening. We just needed to see Link in his boat to confirm. Because you don't believe it until you see it. Correct. It's just like, oh, Link's Awakening. <gasps> what? I cool! Like, I like how zoomed out everything is, though. That is yeah. nice. Oh, we made it. We're here in the mysterious forest! I like the Game Boy Color version of this because, you know, it, it would take, a, like, a weird blue tint to everything to let you know that you're in the dark, mysterious forest. Ooh. Ooh. All foggy and such. Tail Cave. Go there with the key you'll find in this forest. The wind fish is watching from an egg? Or do we not know that yet? Well, he's like, we're kind of on like a dream island of sorts. What? Yeah. Nah. I don't believe that for a second. We gotta hatch that. We gotta hatch the egg we saw on the title screen. So, when we do that, we gotta go find places with things and. Well, alright. And kill moblins. Well, let's and... just focus on, uh, on uh, the first thing we gotta do here. Sure. We need to find a key in this forest. You got it. Oh, I remember this guy. <laughs> oh, you're going to be lost thanks to me. <laughs> no, oh. I'm not. I know my way around here. The Lost Woods. Hey, oh. I found, found a big fairy. Hi, fairy. But I'm too good. I'm too good for your too, services. Too good at the video game to need healing powers. I'm a video game man. Oh, an acorn! This is unique to Link's Awakening. You have guardian acorns and pieces of power. They increase your defense and offense, respectively. For a short time. For a short time. A very short time. There's a specific cave we gotta go to first. This is a whole trade sequence in and of itself. See, I do recall this part. I think after the first dungeon, that's where I stopped. With so, the remake, I should say. So behind where that raccoon was is the key that we're looking for. Okay. 
But uh, we gotta get a special item if we want to get rid of that raccoon. And to get that special item, we gotta get this special item that's in here. Money! Well, it's 50 rupees, but yeah. Further up, I mean. Oh, I see what you mean. Through, th through that door and all that. It's its whole thing. I know the game like the back of my hand. Yeah. Whoa, you have the entire map on the back of your hand! Uh, uh don't look at that. That's, uh, that's a nice tat, dude! There's a piece of heart over there. Oh, I, yeah, I remember doing this. Can't get it yet. Yeah. You we need, need to, to move those skulls. We don't have the item to do that yet. Right, right. See, I'm having two different memory banks being accessed at the same time, where I've actually played this game on the Switch, and where I played it as a kid on the Game Boy. Hit me! Die. <laughs> hit me! Hit me! Last time I played this was, 20, was 2019, so it's gonna be some time for me as well. Your play file said 2020 for hero mode. Well, that's because I had to move the files around to get ready for this Let's Play. Oh, true. We got a, we got a toadstool! Mmm, the mellow aroma fills your nostrils. <laughs> Smells like mushroom. Mushrooms? Uh, nope. You, I think I fucked it. Yep, Shit. yep. No, no, well, actually, you could have salvaged it. Well, let's, re it. let's redo it! The rocks are nice enough to go back to where they were when we come back in. The bats are just heaving and hoeing. It's like, oh, so... God. Uh, actually, you were right the first time. So push that one in, and then the yeah. one on the left, push the left, up. and then to the right, and then push it up. up. Oh, ta Because you can only move them once, that's the thing. Oh, okay. Easy stuff, come on. No problem! This, I was I was but a mere child when I blazed through this part! <laughs> that rock fossil took me a long time as a kid. <laughs> Thank God this game is only like, what, four hours long? That's if a, that. That's the thing about about this game. Yeah, it's it's a it's a it's a valid question. How would this game exist in a world where we have Breath of the Wild already? Well, where Breath of the Wild had a gigantic map that was, you know, really meant for exploring, this one is a smaller map that has a whole bunch of condensed, you know, objects in it. Like, where's that lead to? I don't know. It's gonna be it's gonna be some time before we get back in there. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's it's mission critical to go in there. Nah. Damn. A lot of side stuff. A lot of side stuff. Oh look, here's a piece of heart we can get when we get when we get the chance. I remember figuring out how to get that. I felt so smart. And also dumb at the same time. Rock over there. We're gonna have to come back here a lot later. A witch. A witch. Hello, witch. I have a mushroom. Hello, witch. Oh, I like this song. Ah, it has a sleepy toe, so it does. We're mixing up something in a jiffy. We will. Mmm. Make witches brew. We shall. Mmm. I think it was just. Uh, <laughs> So somebody just recently said in one of the newer Star Wars shows, there's another, uh, like, Yoda-type creature that speaks normal English, so Yoda was just being a troll the entire time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, magic powder, yeah! So what's cool is that the sword and the shield are their own buttons, and the other two buttons are left to sub-items, which is nice. So magic powder does a whole bunch of weird stuff, but mostly it's for lighting things on fire. Can we use it on the mouse? I... I have never tried it. Yeah, let's try let's it. see. Hey, your chinchilla is now... Nothing. That didn't work. Okay, cool. Oh, it was worth a try. You can use it on these weird guys up here. Oh, the, uh, the, the jelly boys. Jelly boys. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> I'm a chase blob, and that's not all I have to say! They talk? Now that I have lips, I fantasize about playing one of this island's songs on a flute! There are three hot local hits! He becomes a guy that gives you hints! I didn't know that! That's changed from the Game Boy version. Oh! He had like a, a some weird Jamaican accent. Hey man! <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a blob with lips! Blob with lips! <laughs> I, I think when, you know, it came time to making this game again, they're like, eh, I don't yeah. we should probably, we probably should. Ooh, that's the chest! That's where we need to go! Well, jump over there. Well, I can't jump over there. I don't have the thing that makes it, that makes me jump. Oh, right. And that fucking asshole yeah. raccoon's gonna probably see me and go, Nope, you're gonna get lost. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. Kill me! Die! Link doesn't get a jump until Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Isn't that nuts? He wasn't able to jump until Breath of the Wild. And thank God he could jump in Breath of the Wild. Thank the Lord. Are you being cute? No, I mean, I really like a jump button in Breath of the Wild. <laughs> okay, well, anyway. Boosh. <laughs> You're in the way. He's supposed to bounce all over the place. I know! He's all stuck in the corner! Uh, this never happened! <laughs> you had him cornered. Oh, it's Terra, and he was collecting mushrooms in the forest, and he, oh. like, ate one, the idiot. 
Biting into a big old juicy toadstool. He's supposed to be Mario, uh, fan theory thinks. Wahoo. Or like, you know, the, like this, ver this world's version of Mario. Wahoo. Wahoo. Hey, Wahoo and all that, you know what I'm saying? Is that Chris Pratt? Oh my god, that's him! <laughs> Here we have... Yay! The tail key! I love it. We can go over the tail caves! Let's hightail it out of here! Let me tell you a tale. Hi, I'm Kapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapukakapuk
been waiting for this. And Rock's oh, Feather! Rock's Feather, yes! Oh, that's the official explanation? Your l body feels lighter? Right, yeah. Because in, uh... Oh, whoops. Oh, well, it's a good it. thing this is up here, yeah. In uh, Oracle of Seasons, it uh, gets upgraded to Rock's Cape. Ah, okay. Then you can kind of float with that. I got a piece of power! Now I'm super powerful! Do you get a text box every time you get a piece of power in a acorn? Well, yeah, you might forget what that's for. Oh, well, this is the second one we've gotten this episode. Well, we're good. It, well, okay. You got me there. I, I think it's based on, like, the amount of enemies you kill or something. Walter White raising his hands. You got me. You got me. <laughs> What's in the rest of this dungeon? Yeah. Oh. 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 Okay. Uh, so what does that tone mean on the compass? There's something hidden? That tone on the compass means there's a key here. Like, this is an optional oh. chest. You don't need you don't need 20 rupees to beat the game. But you do need to open this. It almost seemed like the tone happened when we were right on it. Yeah. <laughs> ah, so, Skelly Man! A one, I think it's a one way. Okay. Well, I might as well go through this door, too. A Skull Child. Actually, those are Stalfos. Stalfos, excuse me. Hey, look That's at that. Skull child. I want that. Can't get it, because we don't have bombs yet. Well, I want... Come back to me. Secrets! Everywhere. Secrets abound everywhere in this game. They're everywhere, I tell you what. Up over here. Or Stalfos and Keys. Stalfos and Keys. Stalfos and Keys. Oh my god, he's cornered. No mercy. None. There will be no mercy. Get out of here. Ta-da! Oh, dungeon map. map! Nice. We can take a look at this map. We already kind of get the get the whole map. All of it, that's good. You can tell where the chests are, which leads to where and all that. Which means it's not required, so right. that's good. So it sounds like you gotta zoom in. Go through here, mm -hmm. and then through this door, and then we go up here, get that. Mm -hmm. We gotta go up there too. Okay. So, I mean, yeah, well, let's, let's go do that. Oh, I love this. Shook! Oh, I one am. way! I'm here. Oh, it actually locks behind you. Interesting. It's kind of sad that uh, this is the only game that has one ways. What? I think so, anyway. I don't think there's any other one ways in, in, in Zelda. Yep. Key blocks! Yep. Use the key to open the blocks. Easy. Oh, Wait. and oh man, I think we might be getting a key here. The Nightmare Key! Oh, wow. This opens the boss lair. Wow. Wow. Or the big key. Or the boss key. Or whatever you want to call yeah, it. Yeah, whatever it's been called throughout the years. See, it's linked to the past. <laughs> <laughs> no, -uh, those are big keys. Not Nightmare Keys. Then again, don't big keys count as small keys for the rest of the dungeon? Mmm. I'm not the, uh... I don't think so. I, I'm not the LTTP connoisseur. Ah! As my peers. Yeah. No. Oh. Okay. 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 I wonder who got to come up with yeah. those. Devs are just like, oh, hey, can you, uh, can you do me a favor? Can you make enemies that are just for one room and that have a unique thing about them? Yeah. This is the stone beak. So if you're really having a hard time on what to do... Oh, right. But, again, I've been playing this for 20 years, so... <laughs> it ain't nothing. I don't need no owl telling me what to do. Mini boss time! Oh, I love this. I hope you remember what sub-weapon you got. Oh! Hey. Ow! Yeah. Oh. oh, yeah. No, you don't, go, you don't go back over there. You don't Get go back over there. Yeah, no, no, no. I don't, I don't think so. I do not think so. Think so, I don't. I want a fairy. And a fairy. Going. I do like this. Uh, the uh, teleporters. Know. Okay, that's in the next one. I gotta go back. If you use that, you go straight to the beginning of the um, beginning this, of the dungeon. This, I believe, is just a way back up. Because you can actually fall in this next dungeon. Ew. But I think I know what we're fighting. Funny feeling. Whoa, it's a big hamburger! I was about to say, yeah, big burger! Buzz, Buzz, Outsider. It's mold a mold dorm. dorm! Oh, those were mini mold dorms earlier. It's, a, it's like your college dorm, but it's full of mold. 
Ew, university mold. Oh. Uh -oh. Please, my dude. I'm gonna die. Don't let don't let Moldorm hurt you. I'm gonna die, I haven't saved. Uh just jump in the pit. Okay. I will Didn't jump even in the hurt. pit. I will take that. Now save. Can I just system save? Yeah, okay. Perfect. So it keeps track of your deaths after saving or before saving? If you get a game over, that is a death. If you save after that game over, you now have a death on your file. Okay, so if you reload your save, you're fine. Yes. Okay. Hi, Moldor. We're back. Let's get a little double let's damage. Get, let's get a little crazy here. Double damage. Double damage. Also, that's the best way to defend yourself against Moldorms. Ah! What? His big bouncy head. There we go. Now shield. Oh, you can hold out your sword and charge it? That seems new. That's awesome. That seems brand I didn't know new. I you could do that. Hi -ya! Yeah! Yeah. Two swing attacks. We're good. See, that's why we need certain remakes, you know? Quality of life. Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, I gotta say, this game has made my life pretty quality. Uh, hmm. Good job in that heart container, by oh, the way. Oh, yeah, thanks. Hardest part of the game. Hardest part of the game. Hey, so, sorry, that was kind of half-hearted. <laughs> yeah. isn't, isn't her name Linkma? Yes, it is. Damn it! <laughs> I was trying! We oh. got the full moon cello! Oh, how fitting. Another reason why we need this remake. They're actual instruments! Yeah, they are. Instead of the five tones the Game Boy can produce. Blip, bloop. <laughs> they did what they could, though. It's 93, I give them a break. They gave you a hint for the next one. Swamp. Swamp! A path opens in the blooms. So when I was a kid, I thought that was, you know, that, that wasn't a location. That was a sound effect. You know, swamp. A path opens in the blooms. So I need to listen for blomp. Well, yeah. Cool. We did it. We did it. That's one instrument. Well, now what? That, oh. Kabur Kabur! Kapora Gabora! Hoot! That is an instrument of the sirens! Oh, I have to oh. admit, at first I did not believe you were real. That instrument, along with the seven others in the set, have the power to wake the windfish. You must collect them all! I was instructed to give you directions. Your next goal is north and Gaponga Swamp! Hoot, indeed! Oh, you said that right, dear fellow, hoot hoot! I was just thinking that's where Kabor Kabor goes to Kapur, uh, Gaburna Swamp or whatever he said. Gaburga Burga! Gaburga Burga! It's just gonna devolve the entire time. Owl! Uh oh. Oh no! I was about to sign off for the day, but these kids seem to be troubled about something. Yo! Hey, buddy, it's serious! Yeah, really serious! Yeah, it is! The Moblins came to the village! Yeah, that's right! A whole gang of Moblins! Then, it's for real, they all went to the house! Yeah, that house, and then they did something at Bowwow's house! It was a really bad scene with the mob 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 Moblins! So, I mean, ah! Fast, uh, find out for yourself what happened. Okay, sounds good. Yeah, sounds good. Now, we'll do a little bit of, uh, investigation next time on The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening! I may have found our first lead. Can you please explore one of the trees, though? You might have missed something in there. Oh, right, yeah. Yeah, so, so check that tree. Uh, check the chicken, oh. if you could, please. Yeah, uh, any clues under here? Hmm, I'm here. I'll keep looking. See you next time. <laughs>